And lastly this week, the Times of London reports that a research team funded by the British government has found that global warming has caused a seven-fold increase in cases of malaria on the slopes of Mount Kenya. In the past 20 years, an increase of 2 degrees Celsius in average temperatures around the mountain has allowed the disease to creep into higher altitude areas where the local population of 4 million has little or no immunity. The researchers, funded by the Department for International Development, found that the average temperature in the Kenyan Central Highlands had risen from 62.6 degrees Fahrenheit in 1989 to 66.2 degrees today. Before the 1990s, malaria was absent from the region because the parasite that causes it can mature only above 64.4 degrees. However, malaria epidemics began among the population as average temperatures went over that tipping point. The number of people contracting malaria during these epidemics has increased sevenfold in the past decade. The team from the Kenyan Medical Research Institute says that while similar outbreaks elsewhere had been attributed to multiple factors, including drug resistance and changes in land use, the only change here had been the rise in temperature. A DFID spokesman said the research had also concluded that emissions from human activity, rather than natural climate variability, were responsible for the change in temperature. He said, quote, The sevenfold increase is directly attributable to man-made climate change. Douglas Alexander, Britain's International Development Secretary, said, quote, The spread of malaria in the Mount Kenya region is a worrying sign of things to come.